Hello! <laughs> and welcome back to Dark Plays The Way! No, not quite. I'm going to play The Way, so that's just fine. If Dirt Played The Way, it would consist of a series of ogling and uh, cryptic remarks. Where's Setsa gone? Hello? Setsa, where are you? It's a really kick ass scenery. Some exposition. See, sets is not that uncomplicated, although I like to make it out. Then again, maybe she's just fooling herself. That way, we shouldn't feel as bad. You never can quite tell. I just wanted some alone time to think. Me time. I see, I've ruined all of that now. <laughs> Things haven't turned out quite the way I thought they would. I suppose I shouldn't complain. I should be dead right now. But somehow I got tangled up with Yuru. If that hadn't happened, I doubt I'd be here right now. <laughs> I've got you feel that way because now I want something from you in return. <laughs> Give me the information. Where have you hidden the gold? Oh, come on, let's just walk a little farther. Huh. Please, Rue, I, I just want to walk for a while longer. No. Rue gets angry. I often feel this reminds me a bit of the uh, History of Vines, if you've seen that movie. Vega Mortensen has a trigger switch. Great movie, you should see it. You'd kill me after everything you went through to save me? Ah. <sighs> So Rue doesn't like Setsa. I'm glad, in a way, because I don't like Setsa that much. Oh dear, this doesn't bode well. <sighs> Fine, I promise not to brutally murder you. Ah, oh, you're such a spoil sport. Spit it out. Oh no! <laughs> Plot related appearances. <laughs> Don't you just hate them? Slade's got something to do. Did I come at a bad time? I hope so. Good. Your last effort left much to be desired. I doubt you will either. I have much lower expectations this time. Man, Slade can trash talk. <sighs> Here we go. I'm coming at you with everything I've got, Slade. Damn, I didn't even scratch him. of a council anymore. You're a curious man, Rue. Why do you insist on aiding Dancing Violet? Exactly, Slade. 
Hypocrisy. It's a two-way street. And I caught you walking back up the other side. Taste some burning retribution. Just don't lower my plunge, okay? <laughs> ha! That's gotta do something. Man, this man has damage threshold up the wazoo. From what I saw, you don't even like dancing Violet. Why would you help her? <laughs> it's true. Are you? Hmm. Some of us have already found truth. Spiro Sparrow Roof. Time for some landing action. Goodbye, Slade. Yeah, we've suddenly accrued plot-based weaknesses. I never wanted to kill you, Rue. Look at what you've let that woman do to you. What? you taught me into this. What a waste of my precious time. A valiant warrior as he deserves the compassion of all. His wound is a sure mark of courage that cannot be ignored. Stop using such fanciful words. Oh, I still don't know why we're helping this guy. I would think that such a noble warrior as yourself would understand why. Why are you in such a sour mood, Strata? Oh. Maybe it's because on the very day that I became famous, the entire city full of my fans went up in flames. What's the point of victory if no one else remembers it? No, you sir are the loser. Strata, you're not thinking about it right. What really matters is that we love each other no matter what. I wouldn't have cared if you had lost in the first round of that stupid tournament. Tournament wasn't stupid. What's stupid is wandering all around looking for your father. You're old enough to be out on your own and I'm tired of looking for him. But you... you promised. I said I'm tired of it. But he's my dad. <laughs> huh. Trouble in Paradise. Next time on Let's Pie the Way, we find out perhaps who that mysterious stranger was and just what happened to everything. Jeez. Whew. Till then, I'm Malefact. Ciao.